Hey, what's going on? I got another great question today and it comes from Austin Shepard and he asks, hi, do you recommend getting a personal radar gun, i.e. Stupido, to monitor velocity for both pitching and bat swing? Looking at what tools would be good for my youth baseball team. Cheers, mate. I've never heard of uh, Stupido before, um, so I don't know about that one, but I do know uh, the main ones. Uh, you've got uh, Stalker, Jugs, Bushnell, and Pocket Radar. Um, so those are like the four that I see mainly out there. I've used all of them before um, to give you my experience with those. Uh, you know, Stalker is great, Jugs is great. Um, they're just really, really expensive. So, I mean, if you're gonna make the investment and you got the extra money, then go ahead and jump at one of those. Uh, me personally, I'd probably go with the Stalker over the Jugs. I've used both many a times. Uh, I'd probably go with the Stalker. Stalker's a little more expensive than the Jugs, uh, but me personally, I liked it just a little bit more. Um, the uh, Bushnell, I don't like very much because I found that it was very inconsistent, at least with in regards to my Stalker and my Jugs. But the one that I do like very much is the Pocket Radar Ball Coach. In fact, I think they got a new model now, uh, even uh, newer than this one. Um, and it actually shows up, like you can show, uh, it's connected to your Bluetooth, so you can show the speed of your pitch, like on your app, on Instagram or whatever. I'm sure you've seen those videos before on Instagram where it actually shows the mile per hour. Uh, that's not this model right here. I have the older one, but they have a newer one. But this thing is way cheaper than the Stalker and the Jugs. It falls more in line with the Bushnell, I believe. I'm not, I can't remember how much the Bushnell was, uh, but this is way less expensive uh, than those. And it's very much, uh, in line with those as far as accuracy goes. I did a video a while ago testing between uh, my jugs and the uh, pocket radar. I don't think I had my stalker in that video. I think it was just the jugs and the, and the pocket radar, but they were dead on. I think at the most, the biggest difference that they had was maybe three mile an hour, but most of the time it was dead on or one or two mile an hour difference. Um, so that to me, that's pretty accurate. Now to answer your question uh, specifically, do you need one of these? You don't need one of these. Is it helpful? Yeah, it's very, very helpful because if you know your numbers, if you know your pitcher's numbers or your exit velocity, right, your hitter's exit velocity, then you can uh, see where they start and you can see if what you're doing is working and you can use those numbers as feedback. That's what I like to use the numbers for. That's what I like to use radar guns for. If I got a pitcher working on something and he's throwing and I'm telling him to, to do something and he's trying to feel something and then he throws one that's five mile an hour faster than the ones he was throwing before, he needs to know that so that he knows that he did something good and then he can pay attention to what he just felt. Same thing off the tee. You know, if you're getting the feedback of the number, the radar gun is giving you that feedback, then you're gonna be able to progress faster because you now know what is working and what isn't working. So it's just a piece of, it's a tool that you can use to become better faster, basically, is, is if you use it the right way. Now, if you incorporate the radar gun with video and the feel of the player, and they can associate what they're feeling with what they're seeing and what the feedback on the radar gun is giving them, man, that's just a deadly combination as far as how pitchers and hitters and, and players on the baseball field can learn uh, at least in my opinion, that's that was my experience with it all. So I hope that answers your question. I'll leave a link down below where you can get the Pocket Radar. It's an affiliate link of mine. Uh, so uh, if you if you like this video, go ahead and support me by clicking that link when you buy it. Um, and uh, of course, if you guys have any questions, let me know. Drop down in the comments below, and uh, I'll be happy to answer them. Whether it's uh, about hitting, pitching, fielding, whatever it is, I'll try to bring in an expert in that field and answer your question for you. Thank you so much, guys. If you haven't subscribed already, make sure you do and click that bell because I got some new stuff coming real, real soon. Love you guys. Talk to you soon.